YouTube, what is up? It's your boy Koozie, and welcome back to Phasmophobia. We are continuing the weekly challenge series right now, all right? This week's challenge is missed delivery. We didn't receive our full equipment delivery this week, so you won't have everything you might need. And you have to correctly identify the ghost type three times on Brownstone High School. So uh, I think the devs are just week by week trying to punish us more and more. So um yeah we're gonna dive right in baby so uh do me a favor before we do give me a thumbs up if you like this video if you don't give me a thumbs down if you want to find your way back for more content like this and other spooky stuff you can hit the subscribe button with notifications on i'm also recording this live on my stream the link for that is down in the description i love to have you come check me out sometime uh but yeah enough pater patter chatter chatter let's get into it um so Sorry, YouTube. I had to cut out the first attempt because uh, it took me forever to find the breaker because I never play this map because I mainly play solo. And if you if you're playing solo, you want to kind of stay away from the larger maps. Secondly, uh, it took me forever to find the ghost, which never even happened because the temperature dropped in like a hallway, which is kind of weird for a ghost location. So uh, here we are. We have um, all tier one items, and it seems like. This challenge is geared more towards the solo player this week because you have quite literally one of everything. So, um, yeah, so let's grab our flashlight, our thermometer, and our EMF reader. We have Thomas, repel the ghost, prevent the ghost from hunting, and average sanity below 25 25%. Now in the first attempt, which I cut out, we had terror cards. So what I'm curious about is if we have those same things or if it's going to be a different... Okay, so it is a different Curse Possession spawn every single time. Which is pretty cool. So we have no Terror Cards, no Mirror. I don't think, right? Why don't you be like Summoning Circle? Oh, it's the Voodoo Doll, which is perfect for this map, bro. And this challenge. <clears throat> Let's find the Breaker first. Or get too crazy with it. Yeah, sometimes you just gotta reroll. The other thing too that I would suggest is if you don't have the breaker spawn beneath the stairs on the left, don't waste your time. I mean, we'll check the the place it was in last contract because I now know. I think I'm pretty sure it was like over here. Second door on the right is the janitor closet. That's a classroom. That's a bathroom. I lied. Okay. Closer to the middle. I don't want to spend a lot of time looking for the breaker. I'll just... I'll take the sanity drain. Low key. Let's just pull the pins while we do this. Okay, now it's something. The paramic is also beneficial. I should have brought the paramic instead of the EMF. Because now I don't know where this ghost is. I think it's first floor though. This will be a cursed hunt too, which kind of sucks. Yeah, we're just gonna raw dog it with the breaker, bro. Let's just pray that it's not like, well, I mean, if it's a Dio, we'll be okay, but I'm just gonna wait out the hunt and then we'll go get uh, our paramic to see if we can pick up any activity if the ghost doesn't come to us, which if it was a Diogen, it would have found us by now. <laughs> yeah, maybe we'll do another Fortnite stream soon. Okay, hunt's over. We survived. That helps us rule out a Diogen because a Diogen would have came to our location like immediately. Let's grab the paramite. 
And I still don't know if it's going to be first or second floor. I need to find my EMF reader. And then I dropped the voodoo doll like over here somewhere. I thought. There you are. You stinky. I'm not hearing anything. How many pins we got left? Should have one, two, three, four left, I think. I don't think it's in here. I think we only have one pin left and then it's gonna hunt again. Which is fine, because we can use the paramic to determine where the ghost is. Okay, we're out. It's slow. Not Revenant slow, not Hantu. Oh, I'm dead. Speeding up the longer it sees me. I'm dead. Um, I'm gonna say twins, because it seems a little bit slower than normal speed. That's probably not right, but it's okay. Good thing is, like always with weekly challenges, you don't have to survive. Welcome back. You just have to get the ghost type right to get the challenge done. This is going to be freaking brutal, dude. I hate this shit. So mistake number one is going in with an EMF and a thermo whenever in reality we should have just grab the paramic. So we're going to learn from our mistakes here. Let's just grab a thermo. Am I the one on my weekly for cursed possessions? Ah, so each pin counts as a cursed possession use for your weekly, if that's your weekly task. By the way, fun times ahead. All right, let's see what our cursed possession is this go round. Um, it is. It's the mirror. Perfect, except for all the classrooms look the exact same. Okay, it's some sort of classroom. That literally tells me nothing. This ain't it. Watch the ghost be in the exact same room every single time. How lucky would that be? Um, That's not right. I think all the classrooms have the exact same design, though. It's not that. Wait, is it? Hello, ghost. Hmm. I don't think so. Could check the mirror again. We're down 20% sanity, though. So we're going to be at 60%, which means the ghost is going to be able to hunt us. Um, something snake. So it's a classroom that has, like, the snake underneath the... Like, it says snake. Or whatever. So we'll just, we're just gonna have to check all the classrooms. I don't, like I said, I don't play this map enough, bro, to know. So it's not this room. Check down here, because I think this is a classroom. This ain't it. 
It's gonna have a map on the left wall when you first walk in. Which hopefully it'll be first floor. Nope, it's not that. That's a bathroom. Oh, I think we found it. Snake. Okay, air ball immediately. It's not an Oni. Uh, this ghost is pissed. And because the breaker's up. Hey, pal. Um, because the breaker's off. Don't remember you answering my question. How are you? I'm doing good, man. I'm doing good. Can't really complain. All right, so we have the ghost room. It's literally all the way back. I mean, it's not too bad. Maybe they, maybe they're gonna cut us a break here. We can take a sanity pill now. See where we're at. Okay, we're at uh, okay, forty percent. Interesting. How much do we get? Well, it does like 25 or something. We were around like 40% on average. All right. Let's grab video cam. Dots. I can't grab anything else. This is where the tier two headgear would come in clutch, bro. The fact that we have to do this two more times is kind of wild. We're not even going to worry about the breaker. Did I? I didn't bring my EMF in here. I think it's this room. It's not this room. It's the next room, I think. It is. Okay. Do we have orbs? Um, not seeing any orbs. Okay. It is definitely freezing. Okay, so that's one of our evidences. Uh, freezing. Touch the door. So we'll grab our EMF now. And we're always going to assume that we get three evidences with the weekly challenge because usually they specify if it's like a nightmare ghost or something like that. Spirit box, ghost writing. It takes so long if you're solo, though, I will say. It just sucks because you only get one of everything, so... You know. <sighs> kind of makes it hard to play with people. Where are you? Are you here? Are you close? Are you friendly? Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? Touch the window. I didn't grab UV though. Alright, buddy. I have that for you. Hopefully you'll be able to write in that. Uh, we don't have ghost orbs. Which means no mimic. Does mimic always has orbs? Got you 100 bits if you get it right this time. Oh god, please save your money. <laughs> uh, I definitely don't think it's a demon.
could be a shade. Because it did do a ghost event, but it is, uh, we were pretty low sanity. Yeah, I think with how long this is taking, I'm not going to worry about any of the optional objectives. We're just going to get the ghost and get out low key. But I definitely think the paramic, and if you have a role where you get the mirror, that's super clutch. Because even though there's no, like, numbers and stuff, you can use the layout of the classroom. Like, writing on the walls or something like that. Yeah, <laughs> shit would not work. Yeah, yeah, don't do that. Save your money, buddy. Can you give me a sign? Please don't change ghost rooms, man. That would make it very, very unfortunate. Um, no UV potentially. Can you give me a sign? That doesn't involve killing me. I guess I'll go grab crucifix now. <clears throat> Thought it worked taking care of grandparents and working also, so I choose not working right now. Yeah. I mean, that's smart. You're doing, you're doing the right thing. Alright, we'll grab salt and crucifix. Go ahead and see if we can get some UV footprints. And I mean, the ghost isn't hunting right now. We have Gen Shade twins, which I don't foresee it being twins. Not at this point. It's definitely not a demon. Look at how shitty the range of the tier 1 crucifix is. It's very bad. Hello friend, can you give me a sign? Check spirit box again. Where are you? Where are you? Are you here? Where are you? Okay, we have two- Can you step in the salt, bro? Uh... Oh, it's haunting. Oh, it's haunting. Oh, it's haunting. Now here's the problem. Is it slow because it's twins and it's the slower... ...twin? Or is it slow because it's a Moroi? I mean, that's like Moroi slow, though. This is not a hiding spot, by the way. Slowly starting to speed up, though. The longer I'm sitting in the dark. Sounds like it's upstairs. I'm gonna say more, Roy. And we're gonna get out of here. Let's go with that. And let's pray that the next two attempts, we get the mirror every time. That would be clutch. I 
I think it's Morroy because the Morroy replaces a curse on you if it responds to you via spirit box. And yeah, I've been in the dark, but like, I don't know. We'll, we'll just see. I'm just happy I have the stream to take my mind off him. Good, Toasty, I'm glad. Was it a Morroy? It was a Morroy. Nice. Let's go. All right, so that was a little bit tough because the twins can hunt, like, either be the fast twin or the slow twin. And the slow twin is obviously, like, slightly slower than normal speed, and that was, like, a little bit slower than that. So, I don't know. But I noticed it started getting a little bit faster the longer it was... The longer I was in the dark, meaning my sanity was raining, and B, um, well, there is no B, to be honest with you, um, but yeah, that's how I kind of figured it was a Moroi. We used process of elimination. Okay, no mirror this time. That's very unfortunate, uh, but we had the music box. Let's see. Oh, shit, it's close. No Nodi Squad tonight? Boo, dude. I don't have my paramic on, dude. So, it's here in the gym. Okay. <laughs> Raid. Where's my thermo, dude? We can confirm that. By going into the gym. And temperature's dropping. Okay. Problem is, we have tier 1 dots. In the gym. Arguably, it is the biggest room. In uh, Brownstone. I'm going to check for the breaker, because this would be very beneficial right now. But I'm only going to check underneath the stairs. Which, it's not there. Okay. I'll double check the map to see if it's somewhere that's I can get to pretty quick. But, I mean... The good thing is, at least we found the ghost room. Play some basketball with it? I I don't know if you can. That would be sick, though. Let's check the map. Okay, it's not even on the first floor. It's on the second floor. Up and around. Okay, I mean, we could... But I mean, if it turns it off, there's no, there's no point. Jaeger, there's no door out here, you stinky. We could play some basketball with it. Let's try it. What if we walk in and it immediately gives us dots? I think I'm going to set it like right here. Check for Orbeez. No orbs. We have freezing though. I'm assuming. Forgive me. Okay, yeah, it's freezing. It's below. Uh, we got a whisper. Okay, that's one whisper. All right, let's go grab the rest of our equipment here. I'm not even grabbing the tier one crucifix, bro. Okay, I'm actually gonna change that real quick because that's getting on my nerves. Hope it doesn't crash the stream. Chat bot. Settings. Custom bot name. I can't. Customize your stream elements bot name. How do I change that? I don't care. I'll deal with that later. Whatever. I don't think so, because it's done through stream elements. Can you give me a sign? 
I'll go grab Spirit Box. Wraith is not an option, so we don't have to worry about ruling that out. Let's grab this and this. Probably monitor my sanity whenever I go back out and get the, uh... I'll grab a firelight, too, and a crucifix. Where are you? Are you here? Are you close? Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? Are you here? Are you close? Are you stinky? Don't tell me you changed rooms, bro. Please don't change rooms. Temperature going up or no? We good? Where are you? Are you here? Are you close? Are you friendly? Where are you? Are you here? Are you close? Where are you? Do you speak? Oh! Hey, buddy! Where's the, where's the goal? Watch this. Oh my god. It's so bad. Okay, sorry. Focus on the mission. Where are you? Are you here? Where are you? Where are you? Are you here? Are you close? Are you friendly? It's genuinely not talking to me because I have shitty equipment. Check the paramic again. Hello, buddy. Can you talk to me? Can you write in the book? Hello, hello. Okay, my sanity is low enough for a demon to hunt me, and it's not hunting. Um, where are you? Are you here? Are you close? Are you friendly? <gasps> we can check for UV. Any UV? Aha! Alright, Hantu, Jin, Mimic. Mimic is going to have orbs. It does not have orbs. Where are you? Are you here? Are you close? Where are you? Do you speak? Are you friendly? This sucks, man. I think I may just have to guess. Where are you? Where are you? Check for orbs again, I guess. Any orbs? Check out here just in case. I don't think so. So for sure no orbs. Alright, so that rules out Hantu. Um, check for spear box. Where are you? Where are you? Are you here? Where are you? Where are you? Hello? Where are you? Are you here? Are you close? Are you friendly? You didn't write in this. I'll leave this here for you. Jesus, dude. That actually kind of startled me a little bit. Okay. Um, well, that actually kind of rules it out. Unless it is a demon, in which case the game hates us. Because demons are normally aggressive. But we're only going to guess on two evidences because I don't want to bore you guys to death. So, that's the plan, baby. This is Sketch Jin. Because the demon would have haunted us by now, for sure. Um, the mimic would have had orbs. And so that leaves process of elimination, which is Jin. It was a Jin. Knowledge is power, baby. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. It's power. I got a ghost guide, all right? Where I cover all 24 ghosts, and I'm actually thinking about making, like, a condensed version. Where I just give you, like, the cliff notes of everything. Why am I grabbing what I'm grabbing right now? 
I'm on autopilot mode. Alright. Yeah, baby. Alright, let's see. Uh, no tarot cards. No monkey paw. No music box. Is it the mirror? No, it's the board. Oh my freaking Jesus. This is, this is not enjoyable. Um, where are you? Classroom. Watch, this is why I hate the board on this, on this map. We just spent 50 sanity. To get told it was in classroom. Three. Thirty-five. Yeah, that narrows it down. Goodbye. Goodbye. So, uh, where the fuck is that? Why? Because there's no, there's no room numbers. Does it start one, two? Right? Classroom two? Because if that's the case, we gotta go upstairs and it's probably all the way up to the... To the left. Or something. Like, back, back left. In which case, I might just re-roll. Oh, it's hunting. Oh, it's hunting. It's normal speed. I'm dead. Uh... That's not an Oni. Oh my god, I survived. Okay, well, um, it's not a shade. Because we're at 50% sanity. Not 35. It's not a Diogen. Um, it's not a Moroi, not a Thay. Ah, uh, could be a Moroi. Um, no Hantu, no Revenant. Didn't do any weird blinking. So it's not an Oni or a Phantom. Um, and he started hunting from, like, back here. So, that tells me... Maybe the breaker's in the same spot it was last time? Hello, ghost. What the fuck? It is not. Okay. Well, that's unfortunate. It's very unfortunate. Okay. Um... Hello? Oh, I'm dead. Okay, he's slow. I'm backed into a corner. I'm gonna die. Maybe I'll loop it. Yeah, I'm dead. I'm fucking dead. Is this a demon? Because he started hunting again. Could be a demon. We're gonna guess demon. But I didn't smudge it, and I can't- I wasn't keeping track of 20 seconds or 25 seconds. If it's a demon, it'll hunt, uh, it's got a 20 second grace period versus a 25, it was a Goryeo. So, well, we wouldn't have had to worry about the ghost ever changing rooms, so that's fun. But, uh, classroom 35, huh? We now know where classroom 35 is. Sounds like you get a pretty good grace period, though. Alright, we go again. Maybe we'll get lucky this go around and get the mirror. And we'll be able to find the ghost room pretty easily. I don't think we're gonna get that lucky though. No monkey paw, no music box. Terror cards again. Uh, I mean, we could trigger a, a hunt with the death card if we pull it. Wheel of Fortune. Okay, we are... At zero sanity now. The tower doesn't work. Uh, the tower doesn't work. The moon. Um, my sanity is completely nuked into the ground. The tower. Say it with me. Doesn't work. Death. The sun. Now we're at 100% sanity. The hermit. Doesn't work. The moon. Well, okay. And death, of course. 
All right, let's listen. It might be upstairs. Let's check. Oh, we got breaker down here. I can turn the breaker on while it's hunting. That's normal speed. Oh, it's going to kill me. I think I'm dead. I think I'm dead. No Thay, no Diogen, no Revenant. Um, no twins. Help me, Mom. Okay, so it started from upstairs. But the problem is, is we're going to be chain hunted now. Because I'm at 0% sanity. It's not a Hantu either because the breaker's off. Yeah, the speed didn't change. Alright, it started from upstairs. Um... This is not going to be a fun, a fun run here. Probably going to die. Hello, ghost. Oh. It's right here. This is it. It's, uh, it's a freaking mare. I'm dead. I'm dead. Uh, taken. <laughs> We're gonna call the mayor because it immediately turned the, the light off right after I switched it on. And then it started hunting, but I'm in 0% sanity, so. Did we get lucky with the mayor? Let's find out. Unless it's Mimic. It was a mayor. We're done. Let's go, baby. Well. There you go, folks. Uh, I have uh, no advice for this. Um, just uh, Godspeed, bro. Because best best advice I could say is use your paramic. Um, speaking of which, we just unlocked the tier three. Feels good. Um, use your paramic. Go in with a uh, thermometer and your flashlight, and then use the cursed possessions to try to find the ghost room, or get it to hunt you and try to determine um, the ghost based on its hunting abilities. Um, that is, uh, going to be the best course of action to getting this done quickly. Because if you noticed the second we started doing that and started using the tools that we had and then using the knowledge that we have about the ghosts, um, it allowed us to kind of speed run this and get this done as fast as possible. We didn't, we even guessed the ghost right on some of the, uh, some of the attempts solely based on only having like two evidences. So there you go, folks. But anyways, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give me a thumbs up. If you didn't, give me a thumbs down. If you want to find your way back for more content like this and other spooky stuff, you can hit the subscribe button with notifications on. I'm recording this live on my stream right now. Uh, it'd be awesome to have you come check me out if you want to. The link for that is down below. But anyways, until next time, do me a favor. Take care of yourself. Take care of each other. Have a great... Thank you for watching. Have a great rest of your day, night, whatever. And uh, as always, don't stop being who you are. You're valued. You're loved. You belong in this community. I'll see you guys in the next video, okay? Take care.